To achieve the ACER Certificate in Maths Level 2, students may need to demonstrate the skill of matching nets and 3D shapes. This requires students to visualise what shape a net will make after it's constructed. It's an important skill because it helps students understand the similarities and differences of 3D shapes. Let's watch this video of a student showing us how to match nets with different 3D shapes. Let's look at the difference between these nets. I can say the one is made up of just squares. This one is made up of four triangles and one square. This one is made up of three rectangles and two triangles. This one is made up of four rectangles and two squares. And this one is made up of just triangles. Looking at it, I can tell that this one and this one will be pyramids because they meet up at points. Then these three will be prisms because they do not meet up at points. Now, if I take my shape and look at it, I can see that it is six sides made up of all squares and it will match up with this shape net, a cube. This shape is made up of all triangles, four triangles. It would match up with this net. This shape is made up of four triangles and one square as its base. And it's a pyramid. It matches up with this net. This shape is made up of four rectangles and two squares. And it's a prism. It matches with this net. Finally, I have this shape, which is made up of two triangles and three squares, so it will match up with this net. As you can see, the pyramids all meet up at the top as a point, and the prisms do not. So these reminders will help you when matching nets and 3D shapes. A cube will contain only six squares. A pyramid will contain at least some triangles which will meet at a point. A prism will contain at least some rectangles. As a guide, you can check if your finished shape matches a particular net by counting the number of differently shaped surfaces on your 3D shape and matching it with what you can see on your net. 